this is Alvin from the Madden Corner showing you how to do a safe boot if you've downloaded some erroneous program that's giving you a headache. Um, if you're in XP, you want to go down to the start menu, click on run, and type in msconfig, m-s-c-o-n-f-i-g. In Vista or Windows 7, you simply just go down to the start menu and you can type that in directly into the dialog box. Um, XP is going to take you right to this um, Vista in Windows 7. You know, you get the dialog box that says continue and you click continue and then bring you to the screen now uh, before we go directly to the safe boot on your startup menu if you go ahead and click on that uh, click start and it'll put the programs in alphabetical order and just look through your program list because another side tip here is that if you have a lot of programs that are on your start menu that you don't use go ahead and uncheck those items because all that does is slow your startup time down your boot time when your computer's loading it just gives you an hassle so also another thing you want to do for two is find the program because most likely it's attached itself to your startup menu and you don't want that starting up also in the safe boot so if we go to safe boot you're gonna click on that hit OK I'm gonna do it right now I'm just showing you when you hit OK it's gonna say do you wish to restart? Go ahead and restart your computer. When you restart the computer and it opens in a uh, safe boot mode, or excuse me, loads, the window is going to be smaller. So you may see a window something about that big or maybe even that big. It all depends on how big your computer screen is. But most likely it's going to be a small window. Uh, don't panic though, that's normal. And then from there, you're going to go to your control panel, hit add or remove programs. It's slightly different from XP to Vista but uh, not that complicated to find that program and delete it uh, one problem you may run into when you get these miscellaneous programs that are holding you hostage is that it may be under a different name like the program may be quick removal but you get to the startup menu and it may be PC removal for Windows or something of that nature so just make sure you look real good at something that looks out of order, looks strange and find the appropriate program to remove it. If you can't remove it from the start menu go ahead and go to your C drive program files and look for the folder and just go ahead and delete that entire folder and get it out of there. Once you complete those steps go back down to the start menu again run for XP dialog box for Vista and Windows 7 type in msconfig again come back to the boot and then you want to uncheck safe boot because now we just want to resume normal operation click OK restart your computer and hopefully your problem should be solved if you ever have any questions you can always hit me up at the Madden Corner that's uh, Alvin at Madden Corner dot WS.